The Trump administration has reversed an Obama administration policy that allowed transgender public school students to use whatever restroom they wanted. Now, this is a LGBTQ community around Youngstown. There's a big one, some of whom are active and vocal. And today, they were critical of what the president is proposing. 27 First News reporter Lindsay Watson spoke with some of them. Lindsay is live in the studio with our top story at 10. That's right. Critics of this rule said that it was government overreach, which threatened other students' privacy and safety. But it's become a whole new battle as President Trump has officially canceled that measure. Donald Trump and his supporters would do better to be f come familiar with transgender individuals and what it really means to be transgender instead of um, promoting fear and ignorance. Last May, former President Barack Obama's Justice and Education Department instructed public Social schools attitudes. to allow transgender students to use whichever bathroom corresponded with their gender identity. It's really important for people to talk about it. We can't just push it to the side and pretend it doesn't exist. The president, as I said yesterday, is a firm believer in states' rights. The guidance was based on the former administration's interpretation of Title 11, the federal law that prohibits sex discrimination in education. I would hope that President Trump would just take a little more time and understand that there's no threat, there's no threat there. And that's what I think it is. People are fearful because they're not totally informed. However, White House Press Secretary Sean Spicer said those guidelines were confusing and too difficult to implement. First of all, let's remember, to the best of my knowledge, that, that was stalled, uh, never fully implemented. And I think there were various reasons for that, um, several legal reasons and several procedural reasons. During his presidential campaign, President Trump said transgender students should be allowed to use whichever bathroom they feel is appropriate. But he reversed his stance after facing Republican criticism. The most important thing we can do is educate ourselves and promote the education of LGBTQ and minority in general issues, um, especially in, in the Youngstown area. Now, in a letter written to public schools this evening, the Trump administration says there must be due regard for the role of states and local school districts in shaping education policy in schools. But it doesn't offer any new guidance other than that. Reporting live in the studio, Lindsay Watson, 27 First News at 10.